is that Deshaun Watson now? And if that's Deshaun Watson now, you're in trouble. If that's only half of what Deshaun Watson's going to be, you're in trouble because Joe Burrow is in this division. Lamar Jackson is in this division. You yeah. gave up a whole heck of a lot for Deshaun Watson, that contract we talk about. It's it's a lot. Based on what you saw, though, and seeing early training camp stuff and personnel changes, do you think there is an uptick and that we're going to see Deshaun Watson be one of the best quarterbacks in the AFC North and really just one of the better quarterbacks in the AFC this year? Or do you think that's yeah, over? I, I mean, it, it's a tough call for sure. Um, and I don't like to put too much stake into training camp clips outside of like pushing Dax Mill narratives and <laughs> just like what, whatever like bottom of the roster guy I can push. If mm. he's balling in camp, I'll do I'll, I'll get excited about that. Um, but as far as like, I mean, we saw what was it two years ago when Jamar Chase was dropping passes. Yeah. In, in preseason, everyone's like, it's over. It's all <laughs> over. Um, so I, I try not to put too much stake into that. The thing with Watson last year is mm -hmm. part of the deal of his suspension was he was not allowed to attend any practices and he was not allowed to look at the playbook. So I think you can chalk some of it up to rust. You can chalk some of it up to he literally did not know what he was walking into. Mm -hmm. It's like you just walk into a building blind and someone hands you a playbook and says, you have a week to figure this out. Um, we're going to roll. And then they're running this like super bizarre offense that's like completely different than they've been running all year. It, it, it was a lot that was wrong when, when Watson came back. I think any marginal increase of performance from last year would be a drastic upgrade hmm. because and i think it would be a big upgrade from at least brissette and i liked brissette and what he offered but he didn't offer a lot out of structure and what i did like that watson provided that i saw at least on la like from the few games we saw last year is he was still breaking sacks he was breaking tackles in the pocket he was able to make plays or at least extend plays you know whether or not he finished them that, that's a whole nother conversation. But mm. He was able to at least extend the play. And if we can get to a point where he is finishing those plays, because now he has a full off season to get familiarized with the playbook and with the receivers and with the coaching staff, we could see, I, I would expect to see marginal improvement. You would expect it though. I, but... I, there are expect Like there's no realm where there aren't expectations. Like, sorry. Yeah. What's it's $64 million cap hit. There's, yeah, expectations. Do you think we ever see him get back to MVP form in a Cleveland uniform? That's, that, see, it's like, that should be the expectation because mm -hmm. it's, again, the contract is ridiculous. But I don't think that's realistic to expect. Again, mm -hmm. it's, he's, it's been a while, yeah. <laughs> you know? So it's like to expect him to get back to an MVP level Maybe we don't say that, but if he can be Dak-esque or maybe even a little a little bit better than Dak, I think that's the I think that's the expectation would be like close to if not top ten. Hmm. So maybe that's that's maybe not an MVP, but if we're like, you know, we're getting into that consistent top ten area, I'd I'd be at least happy. Because then at that point, it's like, well, we have the best running back in football in Nick mm. Chubb. We have a really good offensive line, except for Jedrick Wills. Um, <laughs> we have <laughs> a pretty solid group of receivers, and we've made massive improvements defensively. That should be a top 10 offense and a top 10 defense. Eh, maybe not top 10 defense, but at least creeping back towards average because it was real bad last year. Mm. And then we'll see. Like and then we'll see. Yeah, Almost. I mean that's 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 it. I mean, have you gotten a good handle on the Browns? Do you feel like you know exactly who this team's going to be to this point? Like, do you have your firm like I know who the Cleveland Browns are? <laughs>